As late as 2008, most Chinese did not consider the air quality to be a serious issue, even though it was already was a serious issue. The air quality in China has improved. Uh, most people don't realize it, but in fact, there has been concerted action in the last three years. It's actually Chinese leaders such as President Xi Jinping today who really are concerned about the air. After all, they live in a major city. If they want to take a walk, they breathe the same air as the average Chinese. So they began increasingly, they became aware of the serious health effects, especially contributing to lung cancer and so on. And therefore they began to ask, something has to be done. Chinese leadership is trying to introduce the reconfiguration of how the environmental bureaucracy is being organized and try to make it more centralized. I think for many developing countries, and especially in, within China, there is this perception of very vigorous federal action by the U.S. government. Chinese policymakers and scholars look at the U.S. Uh, in great admiration because they think actually we did the right thing in using the Clean Air and Clean Water Acts uh, to, to sort of to empower the EPA to act as it does. Leaders have a great challenge facing them in terms of it's almost like an ethical responsibility to think hard to act in a way that balance the benefits and bad effects of development. 